everyone, it's Katie from The Review Loft here to do my very first interview with the lovely new author, Mariah Dietz. She wrote a book called Becoming His that has been listed on many people's must-read books of 2014. Hey, Review Loft. It's really great to be here, and I appreciate and really love the fact that you guys love Becoming His. It was a labor of love, and I'm so glad to be here with you guys. What was the inspiration behind you becoming an author and writing the lovely book, Becoming His? My inspiration for writing comes from a multitude of sources. Sometimes it's my own experiences. There's small bits of me that are laced within each character. And sometimes it's very small tidbits. Sometimes it's a fear or sometimes it's something that I find humorous. Um, sometimes it's something that is a name of somebody that I really care about. but. Other than that, I get a lot of it from just people watching and experiences. I love to travel, and it's something that I've loved doing forever. And whenever I travel, I always make sure that I'm being even more cognizant of everybody and everything going around, because within like 20 seconds of seeing somebody and watching their interaction with maybe a person or something, I can create like this entire story in my head about what's actually happening, even though it's not. <laughs> At what moment did you know you needed to sit down and start writing a book? I had my second son and I was trying to read books. I'm not, I've never given up on a novel. Like I'm a firm believer that when you start a book, you don't know what's ahead of you. And so even if it's something where you're a little confused or you're not really liking the story that there's room for drastic change because something significant could happen. So I'm not somebody that gives up on a book. But at the same point, when I had my second son, I was having a really hard time getting invested in any novel. And it's because even though I had some really great stories that I've since read, I couldn't get these voices out of my head. Like, Ace and Max were talking to me and I was seeing these scenes play out and all this stuff was happening and I couldn't focus on what I was reading because their story was so loud in my head that I just had to get it out in order to be able to read a book again. In one word, what do you think of when you hear the word self-publish? Busy. Soulmates? Max. Instant love? Overdone. Thank you, Mariah, so much for spending time with me and the followers of The Review Loft. I look forward to seeing part two of your interview where we will learn more about Becoming His and also hear about the follow-up novel, Losing Her. Bye, everyone. See you around.